unprepared for long war, U.S. Army undergun to make more ammo. One of the most important munitions of the Ukraine war comes from a historic factory in a city built by coal barons, where tons of steel rods are brought in by train to be forged into the artillery shells Kyiv can't get enough of, and that the U.S. can't produce fast enough. The Scranton Army ammunition plant is at the vanguard of a multi-billion dollar Pentagon plan to modernize and accelerate its production of ammunition and equipment not only to support Ukraine, but to be ready for a potential conflict with China. But it is one of just two sites in the U.S. that make the steel bodies for the critical 155mm howitzer rounds that the U.S. is rushing to Ukraine to help in its grinding fight to repel the Russian invasion in the largest scale war in Europe since World War II. The invasion of Ukraine revealed that the U.S. stockpile of 155mm shells and those of European allies were unprepared to support a major and ongoing conventional land war, sending them scrambling to bolster production. The dwindling supply has alarmed U.S. military planners, and the Army now plans to spend billions on munitions plants around the country in what it calls its most significant transformation in 40 years.